this word is from 2 Timothy 1 verse, chapter 3, amen? I'm going to go back, but I'm going to this verse, first of all, amen? Chapter 4, 2 Timothy, chapter 4, verse 2. I mean, uh, verse 3 says, For the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine, or the time will come when they will not put up with the words of God, amen? Plain and simple, amen? But after their own lusts shall they heap to themselves teaching having ears, uh, teachers having itching, itching ears, amen? Hmm. Let me say that again, for the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine, will not put up with sound doctrine of the word of God, but after their own lusts shall they heap to themselves teachers having itching, itching ears, amen? amen? May the Lord add a blessing to the reading and to the hearing of his word. Let the church say amen. 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 I'm just going to go into the simple thing, reject it, amen? Mm -hmm. Reject it, amen? Amen. amen. Brothers and sisters, it is no secret about the days in which we are living. They are troubling. They are scary. They are, tre they are treacherous. Amen? Amen. For everywhere you turn and no matter where you go, the news is the same. Hatred, envy, murder, along with all kinds of ungodly living is plaguing the entire world. And though it may seem strange and unreal to some, it really is no different from the times in the past, amen? amen. And the Bible tells us ain't nothing new under the sun, amen? What's going on now is no different from past times, amen? It's because of, once again, the root of the problem mm -hmm. is due to the fact that just like in the past, uh, at the generations in the past and those forefathers before us, rebelling to take heed to God's word and to the teaching of the Lord, we see the same thing going on right here today. Amen? Amen. Amen. The same thing going on. Now, now y'all didn't catch it. I said, the, the Bible said that for the time will come, they would no, no longer put up sound doctrine. Amen? Amen. Right. And see, this ain't just the, the outside church that ain't putting up with today. That's Keep right. Sound doctrine. That's right. The, this is about the church, those inside the church too. That's amen? Right. Who are, 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 you know, here to go, once again, the root of the problem that many just don't believe that God's word is relevant or needed in the world today. Right. Hmm. Don't believe, you know, you, you know, uh, some try to compromise the word of the Lord so that it would fit their lifestyle right. rather than their lifestyle fitting the word of God. Amen. Right. Yeah. That's what we do. <laughs> Let's keep it real. Amen. Amen. Now here's the thing about that. <laughs> With all that is going on and all that is happening in the world today, with everything that God has told us, that Lord Christ Jesus has warned us about beforehand that would take place, it would seem like that we would take heed and see that God's word is real and true. Right. Amen? Amen? But for the simple fact, as it said, they would search after teaching for their own itching ears, for their own lustful desires. Now here it is. We see the repercussions of every day. Amen? We see the repercussions every day. Look here. If, if we go back to 2 Timothy, he said the time will come where, where, where the, the end of that, in the last day there were perilous times. Where people will be lovers of themselves. Other words, mm -hmm. men will be lovers of men. Women will be lovers of women. Amen? They will, from where we at, they will, be post, they will be boastful, proud, Disobedient to parents, ungrateful, unholy, mm -hmm. without love. Amen. Amen. Where are we at? Amen. We're right here. We're signs of the time are right before right. us. Yes. Right. And yet, they many are just right. still rejecting the word of God. That's right. Right. Yes. Why? Amen. Right we we there right now. Amen. Amen. Right we have these these things are separating. Families, yeah. Yeah. neighborhoods, yes. communities, yes. even causing division yes. in the body of Christ. That's right. yes. Amen? That's right. Even Look here, we got the same sex marriage. Mm -hmm. And we all know what the Bible said. Amen. That it's abomination. But here it is. All sin is abomination. Amen? Mm -hmm. yeah. No sin is greater or lesser. Amen? Ain't none of them. None of them. Sin is sin. Amen? Sin is sin. Plain and simple. Man, it, it, it was an order the way was God presented stuff. That's right. Hey Amen. That was an order. That's right. He said, when he made Adam, he said he saw that it was not good for him to be alone. Amen. So he made 
one for him. Amen. Yes. Woman, a suitable helpmate. Amen. Woman, he didn't. What's the old saying? He didn't. It wasn't. Uh, uh, it wasn't Adam Steve. Steve. It was Adam and Eve. Amen. 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 But here it is. Because some want to cope or uh, uh, kind of cool, uh, keep it cool and keep it quiet and don't go there with it. Right. Even those in those in the church leaders, mm -hmm. those in government are saying it's okay. Yeah. Let it go. Yeah. Well, here it is. God says no. Yeah. Uh, here it is. Sexual place. relationship out of marriage yeah. is a sin. Amen. 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 You Amen. cannot, we cannot compromise and set it to set a standard for our living to fit so that God's word fit us. Hmm. Rather not us fit God's word. Amen. 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 We see the repercussions every day. Amen. Amen. This is what's happening. I, you know, I'm guilty. I'm guilty. God bless you. God bless all of us because if Amen. any of us say That's, we ain't Amen. guilty, we are lied right. and made him out to be a liar. Right. Amen. Amen. God said my word that heaven and earth should pass away, but my word stands forever. Amen. He, he said I change not. I'm saying yesterday, today, and forevermore. Amen. 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 He ain't changed about his plan for mankind. Man. And we got to remember that he said my gift is eternal life. But the wages of sin is death. Amen. I saw God so love the world that whoever believed would not perish but receive everlasting life. Now if we really believe in God, then we also got to believe in his word. That's it. Amen. Amen. I can't take it for how I want to see it. Amen. That's right. I can't proclaim it how I pray. He said if anyone add or take away that those who add to it should add plagues to their life and that anyone who takes away should take away days of his life. Amen. That's right. Look at what's going on. People are dying. Yes. Daily. And here it is. Most of them don't have a relationship with Christ That's Jesus. That's why. But, again, but, but here's the thing once again. Those who preach the word of God are not putting out this to people or putting only the good part of it to that they want to hear just to keep them in the building and keep the tithes and offering coming or also allowing those souls to go to hell. That's right. Mm -hmm. Amen. 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 Well, here's the thing about it. You have been put in charge as a shepherd or the under shepherd. God has put entrusted you with these people lives. Right. So don't think we ain't going to be held accountable, accountable. for it. Amen. Amen. So not only are you allowing their souls to go to hell, but you very well stand Amen. a chance of going there yourself. Amen. Amen. That's why. We cannot play around with this thing any longer. Amen. This is real. This is real. Yes, it is. People are dying without a relationship, without yes. knowing. Yes, yes. We are not speaking the truth. We are only speaking what makes people feel good. Okay, you get that. Okay. Do not call you know what I'm saying? Stumble. Jesus spoke, but it, it wasn't to please the people. It was to please the Father. That's but in order to please the Father, it was also to save the people. Yes. Amen. He didn't do this for his own will, but for the Father's will, and for the purpose of making sure that none go to hell. That's right. <laughs> Amen. Amen. And here it is. Just keep it real. Some of the older ones ain't did it all right. Uh, We've made mistakes. Uh, Amen. Amen. Some are still. Amen. But here it is. Teach your children in the way they should go. Train them in the way they should go. You have to live godly life also. Amen. Mm -hmm. right. You can't live any kind of ragged life before the kids. Mm -hmm. Tell them Imitate one thing, but you're doing another thing. That's right. That's right. Children, grandkids, nieces and nephews, whoever they are watching. Right. Amen. We got to get this thing right at church. The uh, uh, Psalm one of the things said, uh, get right church and let's go home. Mm -hmm. We got to get right church because we're going to go home. Yeah. But I want the home. I believe all of us want the real right, right that's home, right. boy. That's amen. Right. You know, we can't keep playing around with this thing, amen. <laughs> this is real. The moral ain't promised to none of us. And to keep putting out to the moral what we can do today. Hey, you, who told you? Once again, mm -hmm. ain't nowhere in the Bible. I've searched it over and over. All I know, he said that uh, worry not about tomorrow for you. Today has enough problems of the home. Today is sufficient for you, know, uh, uh, for yourself. Right. In other words, he said, uh, 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 prepare yourself for, for you know, you don't know the day and hour, amen? amen. That preparation means we got to get ourselves together in the right relationship and line up with God's will and not trying to line uh, our will up uh, hmm. or, or God's will to our will. Right. Oh, you know, we can't, you know, it ain't going to work. We see the repercussions daily, amen? 
We can't keep rejecting God's word just because it don't fit us. Hmm. Because once again, yeah. there, there's going to come a day when we all going to have to stand before him. Yeah. And going to have to give an account. That's right. And, and, and hey, uh, there's a lot of days or uh, a lot of uh, appointments that we may miss here on earth. But that's going to be one that we don't no, miss. We ain't gonna miss. That's, that's right. going to be one that ain't none of us going to miss. That's Amen. Right. When he says so, it's over. Amen. 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 We got to stop rejecting that word. Amen. Amen. But he, once again, he has told us all these things. Amen. So it is. I'm giving you everything. I'm giving you my son. Now, what more, you know, can God give us? Amen. He gives us grace and mercy. He gives us each and other day. Amen. We can't keep taking this thing for granted, amen. Right. None of us. Amen. 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 He will forgive you. He, he, he will forgive us, amen, because he said his word. If you can't keep on. You can't keep on. Can't keep on. The Bible says that where sin increases, grace increases all the more. But does it mean you go on sinning? No. You know what I'm saying? Then here it is. When you know better, I know. that's right. When you know better, amen. Right, man. You know, when you know better, uh -huh. amen. <clears throat> when you know what you ought to do, yeah, but don't do, do it, it. then you know that's not only a, uh, James said uh, uh, it, it's not only uh, admitting sin, but uh, come on now, mm -hmm. come on now. It's a willing sin. It's rebellion. Amen. It's obedience. He said, I hear this. Say, he who knows the good he ought to do and doesn't sin. Amen. So when you know what you ought to do, but you don't do it, then who can you blame? Any of us. Amen. Because here it is. I do know, but I choose to do this. I'm looking for God to forgive me when God is going to forgive me. But he's also there. He's a jealous he God. You. That's right. He's a he's jealous God. Accountable. He said last week, he said, he ain't going to keep on forgiving for what we know what we're supposed to do. Well, God doesn't forgive when we don't repent. Then we don't repent. We have to turn. People think that that's right. if I sin and say, God, forgive me, I'm forgiven. I got it. No, forgiveness happens when I repent from that. That's right. If that's I keep right. doing it, there's no forgiveness. That's, yeah. Mm -hmm. and we got it. Okay. Amen. Here it is. Here it is. There's two kinds of sins. I'm gonna close with this. There's two kinds of sins that I've that I've been taught about: a confessing sin and admitting sin. Amen. That admitting sin is only you only admit it because you got caught. If you never got caught, you will go on doing it. Mm -hmm. So you just admit to it with probably with the intention of doing it again anyway. Amen. Mm -hmm. But then you got that confessing sin when you really are sorry about what you've done. Amen. And you want to give and you want God to clean you. So you ain't gotta wait on nobody to see you do it. You just go confess it, amen. That's where that repenting come in. God, I don't want to keep on going this way. I I don't want to I, I I really don't like the things that I'm doing. And I want to turn from these things, mm -hmm. God. But I can't do it on more and yes. we can't lean no, on our strength on to do own. this. That's right. We can't lean on our strength to do it. He said I can do all things through Christ Jesus. That's right. Me. Amen. I can do all things, amen, through Christ Jesus. We are more than a conqueror through him, amen. We can't do it on our own, amen. Amen. If we could, it'd have been over a long time ago. Yes, it would. It, the things that we've been doing that are against his will be they'd have been stopped. We have to go to God and get down and bow down. Amen. We are living in very troubled time. And he came to start the building of his kingdom and he's coming back. And guess what? The, that, that thing in the rear view mirror says that uh, 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 objects appear closer. Objects are close. All right, now praise God. We all got to see. We, see, see, we got to go there, amen. Objects in the mirror are closer than they appear. Some say, well, it's been a long time, 2,000 years, but it, in hmm. God's sight, a thousand years is like a day, and a day, a thousand years. So in God's sight, it, it ain't been but a few minutes that he, the Lord's been here, amen. amen. He's been real patient, amen. God, we thank you once again for this day and for your many blessings, for your grace and your mercy. We thank you for your patience, God. And God, where we have fallen short to take to heed to your word and, and have even rejected your word, even in here in the body of Christ, God, we are coming to you before today, coming before you in, in confessing and repenting, God, and asking for your help and for your strength, God. But we cannot do this on our own. We fall short of your glory daily, God. But we do have one who sits at the right hand of you, 
who have overcome everything that this world could bring forth to them, God. And you told us in your word that if we would just trust in you and lean out to our own understanding, that, that acknowledge you in all our ways, that you would direct our path, God. We need your help and we need your guidance. We cannot do this thing on our own, God. So we give these things over to you right here and now. I pray blessing over this community, over this nation, over every person here and outside these walls, God. That God, the, the, from the top to the bottom, from the government on down to the preachers and the pastors and everyone else, God, that we will stop compromising what is true for what is fable and myth and give to the people what they need in order to help save their souls, God, because we also have to give an account on that day. I thank you for the food that's prepared and the hands of the prayer that for each person here who is faithfully here every week for the feeding ministry. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.